over my head. It appears hard to dream in times like these, when one bad day can turn into several weeks, life seemed bleak, and the clouds we saw now appear like a storm that will never cease. To increase the anxiety it wildly drives those who live blissfully unaware to truly appreciate the very gift of being able to breathe clean air. Things can't all be doom and gloom forever. I like to think that there are better days, and they are awaiting somewhere out there. When you can't see colour in a world that is dark, your mind and soul grow stark, as so too grows your desire to tear it all apart. Why? The reason is because you know you tried. It hurts so much you would do anything to make the pain subside. When words can't carry the same amount of justice as your fists, remember this. By the laws of science, nothing can be destroyed or created. It merely goes somewhere else. If you impact the world around you, it only seeks to impact yourself. Mental health has been a trivial matter for many. Look out to the enchanted forest and meditate, would be the words of the hippies. It may seem trippy, but let me give you an idea as to why they are fine with the world's current design. They hold and revel in the idea that tomorrow the sun will shine. They don't doubt that the world now seems blind and scurrying around like they're running out of time. They just take little steps and focus on one foot and then the next. Rather that than wonder how much time they have left. Allow yourself to dream like you did as a kid. A planet made of marshmallows encircled by rainbows, and a cup of hot chocolate in your tiny hands, held on by a little blue lid. The Saturdays when you would wake up at the crack of dawn, and to this day you were surprised you could do that then, but not any more. Or how you could lay on your back and make a snow angel in the carpets on the floor, tracing the tracks and seams of everything like it was one big puzzle just waiting for the world to see. Think curiously, and the darkest day, even for a moment, will shed a little ray of sunshine for both you and me.